Yes, sir. I've got two patrols due back within the hour. I've... Yes, sir. I certainly will. Yes, sir. You can be sure I will. Out. Where would you go if you were a German division and wanted to hide? Germany? for not reporting when summoned? Yeah, oh. they put you in the service for things. <laughs> <laughs> He's already in. Yeah, that's serious. Yeah, well, yeah, I don't know if I was here. Maybe I'll come out and come back and <laughs> come out and go out and... I've been committed to it. Who knows? Hey, what's that? <laughs> well, I tell you. <laughs> I tell the boy, isn't that what it is? Maybe I'll come out and... Hey, uh, Sean! Sean, did you hear? Nelson's got a problem. He just got a... Across France, we still don't know much about him. Not even if he's got any folks. He never was a guy to talk. <laughs> Thanks, his father. Maybe he's got a kid. I had one. Hasn't he been out there long enough? Yeah, maybe. Maybe one of us ought to go out there. Well, you go on out there, and if you need any help, we'll come out. I uh, <laughs> just got a letter from my draft board. They, uh, they want me to report. <laughs> Send them your serial number. Lieutenant Hanley, he a nice guy? Oh, the best. He always gives a bottle of champagne to every new man that comes in.
Hey, maybe that new guy's Johnson's replacement, huh, Sarge? No, Red Rook, that area's already been searched. Come back in. Out. Private Meredith Trenton reporting for duty, sir. My 201 hasn't caught up with me from the hospital yet, sir. You were in for that head wound? Oh, yes, sir. It's doing pretty good, sir. All right, see Sergeant Saunders. You'll find him outside. <laughs> Why don't you guys get off my back? <laughs> hey, sir, we take him back again if he's drafted, wouldn't we? <laughs> hey, if only once you ask for permission to talk to the lieutenant. Well, yeah, well, well, and then you ask her to send you home in civvies and get through the war for a new start. <laughs> Sergeant Saunders? The lieutenant just assigned me to your squad. Eh? What's your name? Trenton? Private Meredith Trenton? All right, Trenton, go store your gear somewhere. Huh? I'll, I'll show you. Yeah. Hey, come on, come, come on. on. Come on, Here you know, we got a real roof over our heads and everything. Hey, Sarge, uh, Lieutenant Henley will see you. All the comforts are home, huh? <laughs> Boy, that, uh, that sergeant of yours, he's not very friendly, is he? Oh, no, don't, don't get him wrong, Trenton. He's really one of the best NCOs in the whole army. We had a mail call earlier. He got a letter that uh, hit him pretty hard. Yeah. Hey, uh, Lieutenant Handy just sent for Sergeant Saunders. Looks like you're in for a patrol your first day here. Well, that's what we're here for, isn't it? Where do I put my gear? Uh, I'd like to get a little sack time. Oh, uh, might as well take Johnson's place over there. Them two chairs. Oh, sure. Well. You all right? Well, I... Say, how long were you in that hospital anyway? Not even a week. I told him to give me a Purple Heart and send me home. <laughs> well, I'd have made that thing last a uh, month, maybe. It's six weeks, even. Well, I got even. I requisitioned ten cans of the best coffee you ever drank. Hey. Hey. Some other outfits picked up a couple of prisoners. Just regular infantry. Until we can get one from the 25th Panzer, we don't even know if they've moved down here. Uh, what do you want us to search, Lieutenant? Casual, John Nelson. Trent, on your feet. On your feet. Oh, Sarge. I had Bede and Lana and Rita fighting over me. I... All right, we're in a hurry. Sure, Sarge. Raring to go. Hey. Here, hey, here. Sit down. You know, it's, it's crazy. I, I got dizzy a little while ago. Yeah, well, it's probably the head wound. No, I, I think my leg, uh, it's, uh... Let's have a look. Oh, it's all right, Doc. Does that hurt? <laughs> yeah. Now his knee went out. It's many you're ready, huh? Oh, I'll be all right in a minute, Sarge. Doc? Well, maybe I could walk the soreness out of it. It's, uh... Walk? What do you think this is, a picnic? Oh, let's go. Oh, that's me? girl that I work with in this insurance company gave me this rabbit's foot. Uh, it, it's always brought me good luck. Uh, I thought maybe you'd like to... No, no, it's still bringing you good luck. Got you out of this patrol, didn't it?
Hey, looks like that weather might close in again. How's it feel? Oh, foul up. Foul up Trenton, that's me. <laughs> Two left feet, huh? You know, I, I think I'm accident prone. Here, you'd better fix a coffee. Hey, <laughs> reminds me of home and mama. Hey, make an effort for the squad when they get back to patrol, huh? Oh, yeah. Hey, you're just in time for Trenton's coffee. Yeah, well, Trenton's going to the aid station. I don't want to go, Doc. I just got out of a hospital. Well, the lieutenant gave me a jeep. Well, they can have the jeep back. Seems like every time I get out of the hospital, I end up in some replacement depot. Well, it's too late. He, he already knows about it. Why'd you have to tell him, Doc? Hey, take it easy. You never had it so good. You guys don't understand. It may sound crazy, but I, I just like to settle someplace. It's a good squad. Look at Saunders. He uh, gets a letter full of bad news, and everybody tries to help him, and... Well, look at me. I... I foul up on the first patrol and everyone says it's okay. That's what I call a real squad. Oh, wow. I tell you what, uh, if I stay with you, maybe they'll let me bring you back here. That, uh, fair enough? Fair enough. Hey, I think I'll go with you. Are looking. Huh. Hey, you guys want some genuine hospital coffee? Well, I'd rather have the hospital, but I'll settle for the coffee. <laughs> Grab a cup. Compliments to Trenton. Say, uh, how's the Sarge? Oh, he's down. That's that letter, huh? Yeah, I guess. Whatever's in it, sure take a hold. Thank you. Hey, Trenton, that's good coffee. Well, drink hearty. There's nine more cans left. Hey, uh... Uh, how's your leg? Any better? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Couldn't you make a hospital case out of it, Trenton? He said he'd rather stay with us. Isn't that sweet? <laughs> <laughs> I told Doc he ought to take his temperature. <laughs> <laughs> but I've got the other squads out, sir. Yes, in sectors J and K that completes the pattern for our area. Yes, sir, I will. The men, too. Yes, sir, you can count on them. Soon we have to go, Lieutenant. Captain says S2 wants you out of here in two hours. You'll be patrolling areas, Baker and Charlie. It's a pretty long haul for men. I just came off with patrol, Lieutenant. All right. Pull out at 1,400 hours. Yes, sir. Hey, I heard about a guy from B Company can make booze out of GI Soap. Uh, I believe it. <laughs> Bleeding and Preston will have it back in two hours. Uh, hey, hey, listen, hey, give, me some, water, water. give <laughs> me some more water. Give me some more water. I gotta wash my socks. This is the first time. You better you. save your energy. I'm pulling out again in two hours. Sarge, come on, have some coffee. Which lieutenant think we are anyway, Iron Men? Well, the way uh, S2 is pushing everybody down the line these days, we're lucky we don't draw three patrols at night. So, uh, compliments to Trent. Oh, it, it's not too bad. <laughs> not too bad? Sarge, you should have seen that poor guy down at the aid station where he's trying to put that knee joint back in place. I don't think you fell that hard. No, neither did I. You know, it's funny, I, I got a little dizzy and uh, I don't know what happened myself. <laughs> I guess it all depends on how you hit.
Hey, Sarge, what's with the new patrol? Who goes? We all go. Get ready for night recon and uh, leave your personal belongings behind. We don't come back till we have a prisoner. I wish I was accident prone. I stay prone the rest of this whole war. The leg ought to be all right in a couple of hours. Oh, how eager can you get? Adrian, how'd you get the cut over your eye? Jeep stopped too fast and I went through the windshield. Went through the windshield, huh? Well, I didn't do it on purpose. Do the him. Must be that letter. It's got to be. What do you guys think? Well, I've never seen the Sarge this way before. I don't know. It's like, like something's gone awful wrong inside here. There ought to be somebody can get through to him. Like who? What, uh, maybe the lieutenant? <laughs> Worth a try. Well, why don't you try him? Okay. Uh, I'll go over and draw a radio. Right. I uh, just want to draw a radio, sir. A minute, Lieutenant. Sure, what's in your mind, Kirby? It's about the Sarge. Does he know you're here? No, sir. Uh, you see, he got this letter, mail calling it. It's just kind of knocked him for a loop. What are you driving at? We well, just saying itself, sir. You want to read his mail? Uh, Lieutenant, I mean it now. Something's wrong, because ever since he got that letter, he's been chewing us out. Who has he been shooting at, Kirby? You? Cage? Little John? No, sir. It's uh, Trenton, a new man. See, Sarge is acting like he goofed off on purpose and just ain't like Sarna, sir. Whatever's in that letter is just eating him up, and we thought maybe you could talk to him and find out what it is. I'll tell you what you do, soldier. You take care of Kirby and let Saunders take care of Saunders. But, Lieutenant, sir... That's all, Kirby. You better try and lock some sack time.
start aching a little. Saddle up, let's go. Huh, went out again. How could that be? I was just lying here. Of course, a little while ago it was aching some. Yeah, well, hang on, this is gonna hurt. Grenades and ammo for the whole squad. Smitty, rations for two days. I sure wish I were going with you guys. You got your wish. But, Sarge, I got... I... Get ready in five minutes. Sarge, he... I said five minutes. sergeants together. That's right. You got a letter today. Is there anything I can do? Thank you, Lieutenant, but there's nothing you or anybody else can do. Thank you. I'll be seeing you. All right, let's move out. Bypass it, one pass us. Keep going. Keep going.
Here's how this place is broken. I think it's out again. Sorry, I think I can fix it. Holmes, relieve Nelson. Sure hope I know what I'm doing. Just hang on, Trent. Back up! Sounded like you broke it. No, no, I think it went back in. Oh, it hurts. It still hurts. Sarge? I think y'all let him go back. Think you can make it back? Yeah, I think so. Who wants to stop you from coming along? Yeah. You're black in your face. We're pulling out of here in 30 minutes after it's dark. You take the lookouts. Give it to me. The Prats are listening of Clobberus. You got a better idea? Checkmate came to this is White Rook. Checkmate. Sir, I've got all squads out now. No word is yet. I expect. Checkmate came to White Rook. Now Saunders checking in now, sir. Hang on. White Rook, I have Black Bishop on the phone. You have any information over? Big pile of junk heading past checkpoint easy. Mostly sardine cans heading south. Do we come home? Over. Stand by, White Rook. I'll check Black Bishop. White Rook, this is the word. Must have identification on all units involved. Black Bishop must have identification on all units. Do your Roger over. The Americans are in the near. And they search the Skelende and find it. Auswärm. Vorwärts. That's a Roger King, too. Out. I still wants identification. There's security guards guarding the roads. We're gonna have to grab one of them. Holmes, take the point. Kirby, you bring up the rear. Okay, let's go.
Might work. Call him checkmate King 2. Call him King 2, over. This is King 2, White Rook, over. Have identification for Black Bishop. 10th Regiment, 25th Panzer, over. Good work. Get back fast, over. Roger. Out. Head for home. That's right. Cage, you come with me, we'll take a look. Two light machine guns and maybe some other automatic power. Uh, they're dug in, but strong. What are we going to do? I have to flank him, Cage. You take little John and Nelson here. You ought to be able to make it in about four or five minutes. Yeah, I thought I'd do it. And once you're set, you give us three quick shots. We'll try to get some grenades in. All right, let's go. Move up and give him cover. Take over Kirby's BAR. Come on. Let's go. service. How many times have you been in combat? Or is this the first? Oh, I know the formula. If you want to live, you stay away from where death is, right? And every day you spend in an aid station means one day less than a foxhole. That's it, isn't it, Trenton? Oh, that's right, I forgot one thing. Uh, now get all the guys in the squad to 
to like you. Make him think you're a real nice Joe. Get him to feel sorry for you. It's your formula for living, isn't it, Trenton? Nobody will believe you. No, they won't, they won't believe you. It'll just be your word against mine. Gage and Kirby and Doc. They're all my friends. They know what you're trying to do. You've been picking on me ever since you got that Dear John letter. Dear John letter? Yeah. Yeah, if it hadn't been for that, I'd still be safe back there at that farmhouse. But no, you just had to keep after me, didn't you? You just don't understand. Oh, you guys, you can take it. You just don't understand. Now, how do you think I feel? One man in a million, all the rest of them able to do a job, and all I want to do is run. I don't want to be afraid. I don't want to. I, I just am. I just am. this kid I know. He had all the guts in the world. And he's a, he's a Marine. He's in the Pacific. About six months ago, I got a letter from him. He told me he was scared. And he felt he could tell me this because I'm his brother. This morning I got a letter, uh, to, to John letter, and they told me that he was reported missing in action. I don't know if he's living or dead. I, I don't know. I don't know one thing. If he's living, he's he's scared. I know what you're trying to do. You're trying to con me. Give me your grenades. I'm not going to ask you to follow me. I'll be all over for you as cover fire so I can get close enough to those machine gun nests. Will you cover me? I'll try. No, I want you to try. I want you to do it. We need your help, Trenton.
Sergeant. Hi. I guess you came to pick up Kirby, huh? Well, he told me to tell you he'd be right back. What happened to Smitty? Some guys got all the luck. They shipped him home yesterday. How you doing? Doing just fine. We uh, heard there was a clerk's office uh, had a job open. And Lieutenant Hanley uh, asked the captain to put in a word for you. That is if you're interested. You mind if I think it over? I just might want to come back with a squad. Well, either way, it's, uh, it's okay with me. Thanks. You know that guy I told you about that was missing in Okinawa? Yeah. Well, I thought you'd like to know. I got a wire this morning. And, uh, my brother walked out of the jungle two days ago. You... Hey, Sarge. All ready to go. 